Remote coaching and child safety do's and don'ts. Digital coaching. Are you confused about what is okay and not? As a current technical member, regardless of employment status, you are bound by all GA policies including, but not limited to child safe and member protection policies. For athletes, coaches, parents and clubs, child safety remains the number one priority. Remember your positive coaching techniques. Where interactions are open and transparent on social media or virtual platforms, these are generally accepted. However, private messaging between an adult and a child is considered the same as behind a closed doors discussion and is not acceptable. When communicating with any child in gymnastics in a virtual capacity, here are some do's and don'ts. Do. Always ensure a parent and or other personnel are copied into the correspondence. Don't. Never communicate privately with a child on social media. Do. Share photos or posts from official gymnastics social media platforms. Don't. Never post photographs of children on personal social media accounts. Do. Only use communication for professional purposes. For example, share new video. Don't. Never upload or post still or moving images or audio recordings of children without the prior authorization of their parent or guardian. Do. Ensure parents have provided permission for athletes to take part in online training and that a parent is present during the training. Don't. Never request children to keep the communication a secret from their parent or others. Do. Utilise a one-way interaction where appropriate and possible. For example, the athletes can see you, but you can't see them. Don't. Never use inappropriate language when communicating with a child. Do. Ensure your presenting coach is over the age of 18. Don't. Never communicate anything that a reasonable observer could view as being of a sexual nature. Do. Check the GA and State Association website for more clarification and information. So, is it okay to have a two-way communication? I am still unsure. Yes, as long as the previous digital conditions and codes of behaviour have been met and ensure that clubs and parents are aware of the class and permission is gained. All presenters and coaches have a current working with children check. Coaches are current technical members and with an affiliated club. Coaches abide by the GA insurance guidelines for coaching at home. And the coach leads a structured program appropriate to athlete skill level. What if my coach is 16 or 17? Is that okay? Yes, as long as the previous digital conditions and codes of behaviour have been met and the previous requirements listed are all covered and the coach is under the direct supervision of an adult accredited technical member. A few final tips. Consider the platform you are using and ensure club management approved this. Consider recording the sessions. Sessions should occur in common areas such as the backyard or living rooms, never private spaces. Professional attire should be the same as if you were coaching. Planning for sessions should be recorded and kept as per normal planning documents.